Good day, everyone. <clears throat> uh, today I found a little circuit on uh, the internet, uh, which is exactly that one. And uh, on the internet, the guy actually claimed that it was uh, able to power a one watt uh, LED. So, well, I said I'm gonna give it a try. And I don't know if you can can see it well, but uh, the value are actually not very critical. Uh, since mine, actually, I played a lot. I played with it. Uh, this one is my little LED, and uh, I test the full power uh, of the LED, and it consumed technically 50 milliamps at close to maximum brightness. And right now, I have my multi-turn pot. I also have scope shot. The down roll right there is actually the channel 2, which is connected directly to the little capacitor which is the one that goes uh, to the emitter of the uh, PNP transistor. And my other scope is connected through a 10 ohm resistor directly to the LED. So that permits me to actually measure the current going through uh, the LED itself. So I'm going to increase it. Uh, this one is actually set at uh, 100 millivolt per division. And uh, if we go up, one, two, three, five, that should be technically 50 milliamps. So let's increase it. And as you can see, it actually does increase. And here we go. So we have a peak of 50 milliamp, but it actually it goes down. So to to have this circuit fully um, work it really good meaning that you light up the LED very very uh, powerfully you would need to know the maximum peak the LED can uh, withstand and then you can actually adjust it to uh, the peak itself and then it will actually go down this is the LED brightness right now it's actually blurring my camera and the thing that I actually found weird is that's my current amp draw which is technically impossible because 27 milliamps for having 50 milliamp going through the LED uh, there's something wrong here so I might have to actually uh, make do a, a scope rating on the, the actual amp draw to know exactly how much amperage it actually draw but uh, here it is it actually works pretty well and if you actually turn that potentiometer too high, uh, you could probably damage the LED. And originally, I was using my big uh, one of these transistor, which uh, I can't find any data sheet on it. So I would assume that it's a power transistor, but beside that, I have no idea. So I decided to use a little uh, 2N222A, really regular one I know they can't withstand up to 800 milliamps and the other one is a uh, 3906 PNP transistor I have an 100, 180 kilo ohm resistor right here uh, this one is a 15 ohm 15 ohm which is actually right now is actually not required because I'm using a pot and if I want to build that circuit perfectly I would just substitute this with a regular resistor and here we go so uh, let me know what you think of that and have fun see ya